Thousands of people who are not experiencing symptoms have gotten free COVID tests in Rochester, and demand for this service is high. So those sites are going to remain open for another month, but they do need volunteers to keep the sites running, and Jack Watson is joining us now with that story. Jack, you're at East High School today. What happened there? That's right, Maureen. And, you know, roughly one in 10 people who get tested at testing sites around the county, according to the most recent Monroe County numbers, are testing positive. And as we test, which helps us track, the United Way is looking for more volunteers at testing sites like this one here at East High School. It's a new year and it's a whole new call to action for the community to help combat COVID-19. Case numbers, hospitalizations and deaths. The numbers we didn't want to see rise are again high in the new year. A record total 802 cases reported, close to 900 people in the hospital, around 150 in intensive care on January 1st. And we are making a call to the community. We need volunteer help and support throughout the month of January and as long as this virus continues. United Way CEO Jamie Saunders wants more volunteers at sites like East High School used for asymptomatic COVID testing for people who want to get tested, like Paul Camp. We found this place, and I think it was in and out. No long line. They kept us moving, and I think that's the right way to do it if you want people to, to get as fast as, as possible. The United Way is asking for around 150 total volunteers across the four Rochester sites. According to Saunders, volunteers won't do the testing itself, but they will play a crucial role in maintaining the operation. They'll help monitor capacity and help with registration, as well as give out masks and sanitize. And it's really important that at this time of crisis, everybody needs to pitch in. Volunteers, including Junco Mills, are trained and provided with personal protective equipment. Mills says helping out here is a way for folks in the community to do their part. In the end, this is what it is. People need to get tested. So I'm very glad to be here to make sure people can come here safely and leave here safely and get tested. 